Little Kids. Um, my name is Rochelle. And I'm going to be reading When Turtle Grew Feathers by Tim Tingle, illustrated by Stacy Shoot. Most everybody knows about the race between turtle and rabbit. But the Choctaw people tell the story differently. They say that the reason Rabbit couldn't outrun Turtle was that he wasn't racing a turtle at all. He only thought he was, it all took place on the day when Turtle grew feathers. Turkey was walking in the grass by the lake. He was stretching his long skinny neck, not watching where his feet fell. Turkey didn't see Turtle napping in the grass. Crack, crack, you stepped on my back, said Turtle. My shell is shattered like glass. I'm not to blame, said Turkey. You sleep too low in the grass. My shell is my home, said Turtle. You broke my beautiful shell. That's your fault, not mine, said Turkey. I'm tired of hearing you yell. Turkey lifted his wings to fly away. <clears throat> Wait, cried Broken Shell Turtle. Let's call a truce and not fight. Turkey smiled and nodded. Let's do what we know to be right. Just then an army of ants paraded by. Friends, said Turkey. Help us mend this shell, then I'll help you gather your dinner till your little belly swell. Mm -hmm. So the ants went to work with threads of silk from the cornfield. They sewed turtle's shell together. Turtle climbed into the shell. It was good as new. I'm sorry for your trouble, said Turkey, but I like your shiny shell. Want to try it on, asked Turtle. I think you would look just as well. I believe I would, said Turkey. Turtle shimmied out of the shell and Turkey climbed in. He stuck his long neck out the front, he pushed his wings through the sides, he poked his long skinny legs out the back of the turtle shell. About that time, five little bitty turtles came, puffing and puffing and running down the path. Everybody hide, the little bitty turtles cried. What is it? asked Turtle. His eyes opened wide. Here comes Rabbit, said the little bitty five. Rabbit wants to race, and he won't be denied. Turkey pulled his mates and legs into Turtle's shell. He drew his head inside and peeked out the front. In a flick of an eye, Rabbit burst into the clearing. I feel real fast. I'm ready to race. Who wants a little mud in his face? He spotted Turtle's shell lying on the ground. Ah, uh, thank you. Let's see.